I share the same agent as you and McGregor, um, and um, when I was thinking of who was going to play Brendan, I I was very mindful that I didn't want him to be one dimensional. I wanted him to to be. I didn't want him just to be a malevolent kind of action hero. I wanted him to have a complexity to him. I wanted him to have a. Um, in the real world, I've met a lot of these criminal types, and they're quite charming. They, and they they groom their um, their prospects, and they and they carefully uh, uh, manipulate people into doing things for them. Um, and not all the time. That's not usually done by standover techniques. That's done by just purely charisma. And and so uh, Ewan's got that in spades. And he's also. Um, I, th I think he's got a he's, he's definitely got a darkness in him. He's played a lot of these leading man roles against beautiful women, and this he plays um, the the lead uh, against a bunch of sweaty blokes, which is I think really what he was. I think he was excited by that as well, playing the bad the bad guy, but he does it in a way which isn't expected. I think he does it he does the bad guy in a very three dimensional way, and it's not like him trying to be bad. It's it just feels effortless and. Um, and I, I think he's like, um, you know, I've been a huge fan since Train Spotting, and um, he, he does do that darker, gritty stuff well, really well. And I think people are going to be really excited to see something different from him. The prison was a pretty exciting place to shoot. We we shot in a real working prison, um, and you know, for the actors, that was really exciting um, and also quite confronting. You know, um, Brenton Thwaites. Um, you know, he he when he gets processed and gets into that prison system, uh, where that was the first day we shot. And when we were in the recce's for the prison, uh, I I had this really dark feeling afterwards and this feeling of um, menace that that travels with you. And obviously, I got a little bit more desensitized to that once I had gone gone in quite a few times. And but for Brenton, he was living that right in the moment as we were capturing on film. And, uh, and Ewan, obviously, um, he had to play a guy who had this, uh, had been in the system for his whole life. And, um, you know, for, for him, uh, it must have been very hard because, you know, he had to be like king of the jungle, you know. <laughs> and, uh, and he was, you know, once those, lo those doors get locked down and you're in there, it is, it is a, a it is controlled and it is safe, but there's prisoners all around. Like we're in our own wing, but they're in the next wing, right next door, and they're shouting at us. They're kind of right in your in your in your in your peripheral. Um, but you can't cr recreate uh, that atmosphere on set. On, on, a, on a set, you 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 know, there's the the vibe and the smell, and there's the the, the things that you can't recreate. And for me, actors respond to those those things and. I think their performances go up another level. So the prison was a real, um, a really great. You know, uh, people are probably going to see the trailer before they see the film, and there's a lot of action in it. There's uh, there's a lot of there's a very thrilling kind of high octane kind of type film from the trailer. They'll probably see that. But at the core of it, there's a there's a very there's a central relationship which is a father son relationship, and um, and they're going to probably come away um, having a really great entertaining ride, but also they're probably, they'll probably just get a little bit more out of it. And I, I, um, and I feel um, a great elevated action film does that. It doesn't force you to, to reinvent your whole psyche. It, it, just, it just basically you go on a great ride and you, and, you, and, you, and you have a little bit of a think afterwards. And I think um, uh, Son of a Gun uh, for me, I always set out to to make it entertaining and thrilling, um, and you know, I, w I always wanted a regular audience to come see this film.